Good day, collective. This is just a random healing and ascension message for whoever needs it. Um, there's some pregnant, low vibrational feminine energy that stole my energy. And I guess her friends and family or child's father watches my channel. Um, think of this reading as you getting karmic justice and me calling judgment for her stealing my energy, okay? What does the collective need to know about this low vibrational pregnant karmic? You have the full card. This Perkin person, I say a Perkin. Somebody's name Perkins, Parkinson's or something. At any rate, they took an opportunity, took a leap, leap of faith assist. They took a leap of faith to move really quickly. They could be trying to run away now that some truth is being exposed as well. What's the full card? This person could be doing April. You're the child's father watching. What does this child's father need to know about this karmic, this pregnant karmic? What does he need to know for his highest and greatest good? Okay. You focused on your abundance right now. You're trying to be balanced spiritually so you can receive the inheritance that's yours. Stay in the ebb and flow with this pregnancy. It's really part of an illusion. Yes, this person is pregnant. However, you left this person because you know that they're money hungry. They can't take care of themselves and they're not ready to be a mother. They are cursed with the Ten of Swords. So what's going on in your subconscious now? You need to know that that baby is an angel with the temperance energy. That's, that's what was hidden from you and this child's mom. Okay, so she is a karmic, but because it's your DNA, that baby is an angel. Yeah, you have the three of cups. You could be wanting to celebrate or maybe you are going to find out about a backstabbing betrayal at the baby shower or maybe that happened already. Either way it go. You're single. You're in your single independent energy. Moving forward, I feel like all you need to know is that this pregnant person is in spiritual jail. She's going to remain in spiritual jail. She already feeling insecure and conceited at the same time. That's a bad combination because you trifling and conceited at the same time. Yeah, you, you that pregnancy happened very fast. Um, you told her that you really wanted to wrap up a cycle anyways. Once you, you know, you all had unprotected sex. This person's mother told her to keep that pregnancy, okay? She didn't really want to keep that baby either. She's feeling trapped right now. Um, it was her mom or whoever she sees as a mother figure that told her, no, she needs to keep the baby. So if you all have been like basically... I don't know, being whatever towards each other. You had other energies involved. She is karmic though. I'm not gonna pretend like I don't know she's karmic. She stole my energy. It's, it's karmic to steal people's energy. What else? Did, yeah, look, seven of swords right here. Okay. Yeah, she stole my energy. I guess it was to get abundance or be fruitful. Six of pentacles, all that type of energy. Spiritual gifts, yada, yada, yada. So to the divine masculine watching, all you need to know right now is that that baby is an angel and um, it is going to be some gossip and scandals taking place with your name already. I feel like you need to focus on releasing some fear and anxiety or you may find out that the other person that she had sex with is incarcerated right now or passed away. She could have had sex with you and somebody else around the same time as conception because she just wanted to, I guess, get pregnant or just, yeah, basically. Yeah, you have the five of pentacles, though. That wasn't smart. That was very broken minded. She's somewhere broken hearted. I feel like you just need to release this fear by practicing self-care and self-control, most importantly. If you scare, you go find out that baby belonged to somebody else because she had sex with somebody in your friend's group. Eight of Wands with the Ten of Cups. Your fear will come true if that's what you feed. So it's either you're going to feed your ego or you're going to feed the truth. Be a Knight of Swords instead of a Knight of Wands in this situation. What does this masculine need to know about the Ten of Cups? You have the Knight of Pentacles, but in reverse. These energies can no longer delay your path moving forward you're going to get a lot of downloads and synchronicities in the upcoming few weeks from your ancestors 
and it's going to make you want to reject a lot of people that normally you invite over or that you spend time at their house with. You're going to reject them. You're going to feel like, nah, something ain't right. It's like a bored, a discontentment type of feeling. That's because they're going through the dark night in the soul spiritually. Spiritually, they're seeing themselves be cursed. They're seeing curses manifest towards their friends and family because that's the seeds that they planted. But you need to just stand up for yourself with the seven of wands. Stand your ground. Stand and protect your seeds, your investments, your assets. This this low vibrational karmic that stole my energy to get pregnant, though. She in spiritual jail. And her friends know it's a lot of gossip and scandal and truths coming out about them at times that they were getting pregnant. See? Sun card, knight of wands with the three of pentacles. It's all been a setup. Your child's mom or this pregnant female her and her friends do this they they set trap a man babies okay they set traps for y'all to fall into it watch y'all on social media find out what you like to do what you're very good at what you're a master at boom get pregnant that's what they do so i'm calling judgment on her she's gonna get karma what i advise you to do is make sure you're focusing on your health your mental health most importantly and stop listening to other people some people want you to try to juggle this relationship. Some people want you to still be this person's friend, see them as somebody you can work with. Drop that tower. They're false. It, is, it was a false initiation, false tethering. And what else does this masculine need to know about the Three of Pentacles? Yeah, you have the Four of Wands. Somebody's home is under investigation as well. It's a group of people that know that. Look. With the Hierophant energy, they know that their home or where they do their work at is under investigation because some type of money didn't come through that they were expecting. They normally get their money quick. It's been a delay, and that's how they know that karma's coming. So, if look, Ace of Swords with the Page of Pentacles. It's evidence, and you already know the truth. The idea that you have um, from what you've been paying attention to along with your attorney, y'all are right where you're supposed to be. Keep doing what you're doing. Keep doing what you're doing. So my twin flame energy is out here. Anytime you feel like you're in a lack mindset, it's because one of your exes or one of your business partners or one of your associates decided to try to bind you, your sacral chakra energy with the low vibrational karmic in their coven. Because whoever they've been calling on, deities, entities, ascendant masters to help them have left. So they're just literally finding random people to try to feed off of. This is how they look. In the moment that they see somebody's solar plexus energy come, everybody is like trying to grab at it. So make sure you're not taking this situation personal. I'm definitely not. Look at everything from a higher perspective. Pay attention to your dreams. And also, if you feel like you need to try to protect something or someone from a situation from the past, I would say just communicate that and then leave it be. If somebody doesn't want your help, they don't want your help. You can't make somebody accept your assistance just because you're smart enough and you've been paying attention, you know what's going on and things like that. Spell work involving a Leo child is also going to come out. Somebody did spell work on a Leo placement child. Or this child is a Libra. It's going to be justice, though. It was an investigation taking place. So I know we've been seeing deaths of children and things like that. Somebody's uh, passed over child is about to get justice because spell work was involved. That was the cause. This is going to cause heartbreak for that child's grandmother watching. My condolences. Whatever evidence you feel like you know you have, go ahead and that'll speak up to who you need to speak it up to. And that'll go ahead and end this cycle for you. And you can continue moving forward. Anything else my collective needs to know? Death. Accept it. It's a part of life. Rebirth and transformation. Accept things have to come to an end. And get to calmer waters. You're being guided to keep moving forward. Because you're closing out cycles. You have masculine ancestors that were very athletic, competitive, and into sports. And they're going to keep exposing truths, truths about certain women. And those women are going to have to walk away 
from continuing to do love spells or lure in. It's not really Jezebel energy. It's more of like just getting into the psyche of our strong men that's supposed to be earth warriors and protecting us. It's been feminine energies um, messing with their psyches and their astral waters. But after this message, they're going to be forced to leave. As you can see, death, high priestess, queen of cups, eight of cups. Anything else for my uh, viewers? Anything else they need to know for their highest and greatest good? Closing out this message, you guys, you have the six of wands and the seven of pentacles. Make sure you always give your attention to the things that you want to receive back in return. Make sure you're paying close attention to yourself expressing gratitude for successful investments, for successfully achieving healthy choices and decisions at times you are feeling very stressed out and burdened you need to congratulate yourself but also keep the vision of your future at the main frame as you're building your power meditating working with your ancestors and also communicating with other energies about what's happening and taking place with this pregnant female okay thank you for watching if it resonates hit the thumbs up button if you got some healing vibes some self-care and awareness and you're just ready to go ahead and move forward in life subscribe to my channel. <laughs> Talk to you later. Bye.